today I'm going to be talking about women in dress codes. About half a year ago, I got into this very feminist mood because I noticed how prevalent sexism was, and the people that I observed spouting off these sexist views were both those whom I knew and didn't. Before going on, I have to say that this is not about school uniforms. I feel that that is a completely different issue, and that they should remain separate issues. I'll talk about this in some other video. In the US, especially the South, some schools such as middle and high schools have dress codes that students need to abide by. For men, it usually has to do with anything that could be baggy or too short, or anything that could be affiliated with a gang. For women, it's concentrated on the length of their shorts and skirts, and if their shoulders or midriff is showing. I take personal offense with dress codes because in my third and last high school in Texas, I constantly got in trouble for breaking the dress code. I was paranoid about making sure my skirts weren't too short. I think the limit was about four inches above the knee, but I was still being picked out by administrators. I looked at all the really skinny girls and envied how they were able to get away so easily with breaking the dress code, and I found that other curvy women also had the same bad luck as I did. I joked that my knees were just too sexy. Now, I had quite a few people, men, tell me that these dress codes should exist because guys get distracted. Don't tell me that BS. Humans are able to exercise self-control, no matter which sex or gender. If a boy is getting distracted by a girl's shoulder, why should it be the girl's fault? By enforcing the majority of female dress codes, we as a society are telling women that we need a dress to enable a man's success, and to not dress for ourselves. I found an article of this one woman who defended dress codes because she felt that dressing professionally is in a school's best interest. Well, that could be true, but tell me, why is it that girls can't be allowed to wear spaghetti straps or short skirts, but can wear sweats and t-shirts? Nice try. But if, it, but if dress codes were really about dressing professionally, the schools would state that students are expected to dress business casual. Don't be fooled by why schools claim dress codes are necessary. Even if they themselves buy into the claims that it promotes a better learning environment, just look at how students, especially girls, are impacted in real life and tell me straight in the eye that dress codes are necessary and fair.